This episode of the Camo Clan is brought to you by these fine sponsors. Axion Archery. Hex Stealth Screen, the evolution of concealment. Robinson Outdoor Products. Thermocell Mosquito Repellent. Goat Tough Products. Insights Wildlife Nutrition Solutions. Dead Ringer Broadheads. Matthews Incorporated. Catch us if you can. Hey guys, we're over here at another one of our locations. Coming in, this is a new track of land we just picked up. It's mid-August right now and we're coming over to, we did some scouting around in. What we got here is a, there's a cut over on the land next to us. We got a strip of pine and oaks mixed through here. We're gonna go in and put out some buck draw from Insight Nutrition, dump it out, put a camera on it and see what we get coming in here. Cause this is a good peanut based product here that man dear we've we've had some good results with it deer to love this stuff it's something you can put out that draws deer in and keeps them in in your area so we're gonna go dump some out and put a camera on it and come back keep checking it next couple months up to hunting season and see if we can find anything and another thing guys I can't stress it enough is make sure when you go in and out of the woods putting in bait or doing any kind of scouting make sure you use some kind of scent eliminator spray to spray down this right here scent blocker trinity blast is an excellent product just make sure you use something to spray down and keep your scent eliminated when you're going in and out of the woods Put it out. October now here in Louisiana. We've been scouting in and out of this area for the last couple months, baiting it up with a buck draw, insight nutrition products. Tell you what, we're starting to see a lot of deer sign in here. We had a lot of small bucks and does coming in at first, but now we've done started seeing some good bucks in the area. See they're making some horn rubs in here, good scrape line. There's several of these down through here. Our, our stand's just right here, about 30 yards from us. This is where it starts in that, the acorns falling. We've actually quit baiting it up now. Just, the acorns are starting to fall, so we used the, that buck draw throughout the, the slow months there and just getting the deer in this area. And it's, man, and we've had some real good results with it. I can't wait, we're gonna, we're gonna get back in here and start hunting this spot here pretty hard. Tell you what, I'm looking forward to this spot. We've got some, we've got a nice eight point in here on the camera. That's a, he looks like he's a, about a six year old deer, mature deer. He's been coming in at night on our cameras, but tell you, as it gets a little later in the year, he'll start slipping up, we hope. So y'all stay with us because this is a good spot right here. Scent Blocker 1.5 is made for the heat and humidity of early season hunts. It's the lightest, thinnest, most comfortable scent control in the world. Hey guys, we're gonna go get on the stand here this evening. Hey, what this is a beautiful evening. The cold front just came through and the temperatures are right. Deer movement's been right. 
you know what we got a lot of deer sign in this area I'm gonna slip in here do a little self filming this evening and see if I can get it done I'll tell you what this is a beautiful spot a beautiful evening so y'all stay with us it's gonna be exciting Insights Nutrition products are engineered for taste and nutrition. Buck Draw is the ultimate supplement that will provide your deer with the energy they are lacking along with the taste they desire. Buck Nut, a concentrated sugar and peanut attractant, and Buck Strut, the sweet syrup with five pounds of sugar in every bottle will become a deer's favorite treat. Insights products will bring that big buck by your stand and will keep bringing him back until he's on your wall. Insights Nutrition, draws them in, keeps them in.
just shot a nice buck. Self-filming everything. I seen him circling around through the woods. Had a little nubbin head here eating. Feeding around in here in acorns. Seen bucks circling around through the woods. I got my grunt and hit it a couple times. He turned around and came back to me. Got him on everything. He circled around. Got right out here in front of me and the wind was blowing right that way. It got, he hit my wind, turned around to get. So I didn't get the I didn't get the shot on on video. It looked like it was a good shot. Oh man. Thank you, Lord. Books like that in Louisiana are hard to come by. That'd definitely be my biggest Louisiana buck with a bow. Holy, oh, it stinks. He got out of my video. Whew, man. What a beautiful deer. Tell you what, that self-filming is tough, man. Just thick stuff like this. I had him several times. I could have shot him. But I just couldn't. And every time I'd go to draw back, he'd come out of my out of video. I'm gonna call George and we'll probably go get something to eat and give him a couple hours and come back and, and get on him. I seen him run out there about 60 yards. I seen him cut in the wood, so. Hopefully he's down. Thank you, Lord. Surgically sharpened spring steel blades for devastating wound channels. The highest quality aircraft grade aluminum barrels. Case hardened steel tips for bone crushing power. When you demand maximum penetration and durability in a broadhead, make sure it's a dead ringer. Dead Ringer Broadheads, there will be blood. All right, we're back out here now. and It's about been about three hours since I shot him. I wasn't able to go back and look at the footage because I was self-filming this evening and the deer had winded me, was staring me down, and turned around and started getting back out, and I had to make a quick shot, and went back and looked at it, and he had stepped out of my camera, so didn't get to see it, so we went, give him about three hours, but there's real good blood everywhere. I would walked in, and about, my stand's about 50 yards back up there, so there's good blood everywhere, so let's go see if we can find him. Blood everywhere through here. Didn't he? he didn't go on that thick cut over jump. Oh man, look at all that blood. Oh, yeah. Tell you what, we're shooting that. Super Freak Broadhead two blade from Dead Ringer. My goodness, it opened that sugar up. There's blood everywhere. It's good no way far. It looked like a good shot, but he was quartered away from me. So I should have went up through the liver and lungs, everything. Yeah. Oh, I 
you open them up, huh? Maybe I hit you more. More. Turn it right there somewhere. There's some on these bushes. Look at it, George. <laughs> yes, sir. Give me some. Oh, yeah. Goodness, man. Damn, look at that body on that thing. That's a crazy mess. Look at that white tail. Man. My goodness. I tell you, I had to hit him way back, but he was quartered. He was quartered about like that. That thing came out. Oh yeah, look at that. It came out right under that, right under that front shoulder. Perfect shot. My goodness, look at the body on that thing. Dude, you gonna hold this light for me? Make sure we got enough light to see this dude. Look at that, look at that. My goodness, man. Look at that buck. What a buck, son. Huh? Man. Eight point, got a couple little kickers right here off of brow time. My goodness, look at the body. That's got to be a 250 pound deer in it. So he's over 200. 2250 somewhere in there. My goodness, what a deer. Beautiful. Hey, what, look at that neck. He's in full rutting already. What a beautiful deer, son. Hey. My biggest Louisiana whitetail with a bow. Tell you what, man, we hunt, we hunt hard in Louisiana. It's a buck like this here is a trophy. My goodness, what a deer! Tell you what, that trauma, that uh, super freak broadhead did him in. I say he went a couple hundred yards. Yeah, probably so. Man, what a body on him! Man, look at that head on him. Looks like a mule. Yeah, beautiful. Sure, dear, that's definitely a five, at least a five year old. Damn, what a buck. You get the truck, so we can get him out of here. Get him to the taxidermy. What a deer.